school, Coma Park Senior High School. My name is Striker Thompson, and I'm here to talk to you about the uh, issue that is on many of mine of the Coma Park Senior High School student, and that is the upcoming uh, prom in the month of May. People may have a lot of questions like this, such as, does prom actually exist? Why are there so many unicorns? Where can I buy a date to prom? Well, I will answer all of this and more on Real Talk today. So, I'm Strucker Thompson here, back with uh, some more information on prom on Real Talk. I'm here with Mr. Misik, the alleged principal of Como Park Senior High School. So, Dan, does prom actually exist? Well, first off, I'm not the alleged principal. I am the principal. Well, okay. And prom does exist. Well, that is uh, very good to hear. Could you please uh, tell the kind viewers of Como Park Television when and where the prom of 2013 is taking place? It is on May 18th at the Dancer's Studio at the corner of University and Snelling Avenue. Allegedly. Okay, so now... No, it's not allegedly. That's exactly what it is, Mr. Thompson. Now, who exactly can go to prom? Como Park juniors and seniors can go to prom and they can bring a, a guest from somebody outside of school if they, get, if they fill out a guest permission form or they can bring an underclassman if they wish. Now, why is there the disparity and the class division at prom? Why are only juniors and seniors allowed to go to prom? The prom is a special event that to honor the juniors and seniors as they get older. It's a, it's a more special event. The, for the most part, the younger students aren't ready for that. And then they're also, it's, it's an honor for juniors and seniors. But surely, Dan, uh, being a public school, you would think that we are here to more communist uh, principals here at Como Park Senior High School and not the uh, capitalist division of class that uh, are being brought upon down us at this year prom. I have no idea what you're talking about anymore. Exactly. Now, can you comment on the allegations that there's going to be a full body cavity surge before prom? That will not occur. Are you sure? Yes, I'm sure. Allegedly. No, it's not allegedly. It's the truth. Okay, well, I still would not advise you to eat any solids the uh, 24 hours prior to prom, just in case there is a full body cavity surge. You never know what precautions they are going to be taking to avoid the smuggling of any illicit substances. Well, thank you very much, Dan, for having uh, me here today to interview you. Do you have anything further to say to the kind viewers of Como Park Television? No, I'm looking forward to a great prom. I think it's going to be a great time. Students have a great time, and it's a really good experience. Sure. Well, now that you know a little bit more about prom itself, uh, we need to arrive at the most important question regarding prom. How do I ask someone to prom? Well, it has to be a grand event, but you must be very careful. I'm going to go over a few scenarios that might seem like a good way to ask someone to prom, but really are not. The first is the shotgun prom. Anders, I'm pregnant. Well, I guess we have to go to prom together then. Another way to ask someone to prom is the classic bomb threat. What's going on? Hello, Striker Thompson here with more of Real Talk on Prom. I am here with... Clint, American Security. Allegedly, and uh, so now, Clint, I have a question. Um, would it be a good idea to actually stage someone's kidnapping and tie them up and gag them in order to ask them to prom? No, that is definitely illegal. Are you sure? But what if it's really cute and they say yes? It is still illegal. Well, there you have it. It is illegal to uh, kidnap someone and ask them to prom. So if you are planning on doing it, don't get caught. 
Some other ways to ask people to prom that seem like fantastic ideas at the, at the beginning but do not turn out so well will be uh, writing prom in blood on their walls with your name signed underneath it because then they will know who wrote that and also trying to ask five different people to prom at the same time in hopes that they will all go with you. Neither of those things are very good ideas and I highly advise against them unless you are sure they will work. Thank you very much. This has been Stryker Thompson on Real Talk.